one who has gone beyond the three gunas, he thereafter lives in life careless of whatever the vasanas that are in him. Hey? Having woken up from the dream, with that waking consciousness, if we are allowed to re-enter our last dream, how will you react in the dream place? In the dream, the good old dream wife, dream children, dream jungle, dream forest, all that old dream, but you have woken up. With the waking consciousness, you are re-entering the dream. You will not say that, hey, wife and children, you are not my wife and children. You don't know who I am. No, you play with them. Honey, I love you and all that stuff. Knowing fully well that these wife and children are only my own mind related. Uh, at that time, suddenly we heard a roar very near us. And between the trees we saw some black spots on a yellow skin slowly moving. A spotted tiger. Surely my wife and children will run inside, lock the door and scream through the window. What a fool you are! The tiger, run, run! But the door is locked, my dear. <laughs> what will be my reaction to the tiger? I enjoy every minute of it. What a beautiful tiger. How wonderfully my mind has projected. Exactly like a tiger. Real tiger. The tiger comes near and... Yeah. Not only it is a beautiful shape, but it is behaving like a true tiger. And then the tiger jams and holds one palm on your shoulders. Do you think that you will get frightened? When you know that it is... Think? You made it. Why should you get frightened? Similarly, coffin is never frightened by the horrible face of the Swami Shinmayananda. <laughs> because he is creating a horrible face. Uh, having done it, I got frightened. No, because he is the author of it. Once you have awakened and the waking state of consciousness with which you can re-enter, if you can re-enter your dream, your reaction and your behavior there will be totally different from what you would be react how you would be reacting if you are also a dreamer. If you are a dreamer, no doubt about it. Before wife and children reaches the house, you have already reached the house, and you lock the door. Think. Frightened out of your wits, because the tiger is a threat and a danger. But when you have already know that I am the waker, comfortably sleeping in my own bed, and this is all a disturbance in my mind, I congratulate the mind for creating such a beautiful picture. I am not at all frightened. No anxiety for the future. No regrets of the past. No excitement in the present. Shantam Shivam Sundaram. I am always peaceful, whatever be the grinning situation all around, because I know that these are all a disturbance of my mind, and I am really the waker. You understand? In the same way, when once you have a titaha, once you have gone beyond the goodness, you are in a different plane of consciousness. And therefore, you are not at all worried whether at this given moment the rajas is more, or sattva is more, or tamas is more. I don't protest against it because I don't act according to it. They are there. Nor am I anxiously waiting to gain the sattvic quality in me. Let the mind function. They are I am
How is it that you are not able to be get uh, disturbed by the vasanas, by the qualities, sattvic or rajasic or tamasic mood? You are not affected. Why? Udasi navadasi. Such a master who has reached it, or when you reach there, you become udasina, udasina, indifferent to what the mind thinks or the body suffers or the intellect's condition. You become udasina, indifferent to them all. Guna navijayade. And the gunas, the agitations of the mind, all the quietitude of the mind, or the dullness of the intellect cannot affect. You are no more identified with the body mind intellect. You have gone beyond it. Whatever will be the condition of the body mind intellect is not affecting you. Gunas can affect only the body, the mind, the intellect. It is immaterial. You are no more in the boat. You remember? Ocean has got always waves. The boats that are boat that is floating on it will be going up and down. If you are in the boat, you have to go up and down. But when you are come out of the boat. The boat may dance, but you sit firmly on the ground and watch your boat dancing. The b dancing of the boat cannot affect you because you are not in the boat. You and I at this moment, we are identified with the BMI. The BMI is being tossed about up and down because of three gunas and therefore we are very anxious about Udasi Navadasi Gunair Navichalyade, he is not tossed about by the gunas. Gunavartanda Yiteva, he knows there are the gunas working in the mind. Just as you sit on the sands of the beach and you know that your boat is going up and down because of the ocean, you know it. But it doesn't touch you, affect you, because you are not in the boat. Yovadishtade Nengade, he never, Ingade, Ingade means flutters. The flame is generally used, Ingade, flutters. You are not affected by all the storms that may be rising in your mind and register, or the darkness that comes in your bosom because of tamas, or the creativeness that comes in the peaceful, serene mind. Nothing affects you. Why? You have gone beyond to be the pure state of consciousness. Huh?